Hello, I'm Lujun, and in today's video, I'll be playing some PvP and random dice with the yin yang dice. And this is another live commentary. Yes, it is. I am playing this live right now. Yeah, so I recently got the yin yang dice from a card box, and I I have nothing else to say other than this dice is very OP. It's one of the dice where it's like combo before it's nerf. And this guy is about to lose. I don't know why. I don't know what he's doing. But yay, free win. Okay. So, terrible start to the video. But let's get into the second game. Because this one honestly doesn't count. Okay, so we are in the second game. And it is actually another uh, Ying Yang um, user. So, basically, uh, the reason I have the iX10, it's... Um, two reasons first of all i don't know three reasons i don't have the royal dice because the royal dice is so much better than the ix dice um against another yin yang player second ix10 does a lot of damage does 10 i uh, know not 10 100 damage per hit which is honestly a lot like considering this is a mergeable dice and third it's to counter other yin yangs of course Royal, as I said, is honestly a lot better, but the reason I'm not going for Royal is because I don't have Royal, and yeah, this is all I can really do. So, basically, a tip here is try not to uh, merge him and try to use Switch efficiently. Yeah, that's all you have to do, pretty much. Try not to merge. Um, I have two two rows done. Um, this row is not done, so I'm going to actually merge this because it's not done. And we're slowly getting there. I feel like we are going to get caught up with the knight. However, um, if I'm not lucky, I might have to go for a desperate merge with the IX10 if I really want to survive. No, we don't have to. I don't think. Please insta kill it. Please insta kill it. Thank you. Thank God. Thank God. This guy's screwed. <laughs> That's basically what you have to do. Um, that was pretty good RNG. Honestly, I think RNG did the most out there. It wasn't really my skill or anything. I think RNG was my uh, savior. Anyway, now it, the game is very easy. Basically, you just have to kind of merge these IX-10 to make him annoying. That's, that's pretty much it. <laughs> What else can I do? Hmm. I can do this and, you know, do that and merge that. So you at least want at least five pips that are activated both, um, red and blue. So that's what I did there. Um, hmm. I'm actually, okay. This might be a gamble, but I don't think I'm gonna lose immediately. So I'm going to go for that. It's a lot safer, and again, it's plus one more pip, even though you're wasting more pips. But again, it's activated, and this guy's about to lose. Never mind, this guy got in. Okay, nice. I mean, I gotta show you guys something, right? You know, something that I learned throughout, like, my five games of playing this dice. Uh, I don't think we need switch anymore. I feel like this is gonna be activated soon. Let's just insta-kill this boss, and let's see what we can do. So my goal for my IX-10 is banning those two on the top. This guy is over merging. That's not great. So I'm actually going to do this. Perfect. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. That was perfect RNG. Perfect. Oh my god. Yeah, this guy's mad. Yeah, bro. Bruh. This is how you beat IX-10. So we are on to number... um. Not number. We are on to game three. Good start, honestly. I always have bad RNG, or you know, I just play terribly, you know, in these recordings. But wow, that was pretty good, I think. Another tip here is try getting three of them, like one, two, three, not one, two, three, four, five, because it's a lot easier and it's a lot safer, and it, you know, it does more damage. So. It helps you survive. Also, if you can put them um, a little bit on like this side of the board, um, the time to travel for the 
little balls that they shoot it's shorter the distance is shorter from the mob than the dice itself so it, you will hit faster i guess i i always recommend powering up at least once when you have at least one side activated um again try go try aiming for uh three not five because five is kind of hard uh, i'm gonna go for the middle one i i think let's just do this so i don't i think i'm gonna get hit by the meteor um there's really nothing i can do this guy has his thing activated already so um yeah dang it no oh no so close dang it what it's activated no it's not is this a bug what what is this bug oh oh what? that was so weird all right so let's just play it safe oh that was whew. ban no uh I'm gonna go play safe. I'm gonna calm down. <laughs> Ban. Yeah, get wrecked. <laughs> so now if he if he tries to activate, okay, never mind. So if he tries to activate that three pip, he would lose immediately because you know too much damage. And this guy cannot activate his. All right, so on to uh, game four, I believe. Okay. Oh my God, this is terrible. At least we have switch. The switch is gonna allow us to at least sustain a little bit, but it's not looking good. It, it's actually not looking good. This guy has typhoon. He's gonna push, you know, the the mobs in very quickly. Switch has a fast fire rate, plus it does good damage, so. I highly recommend uh, using Switch on this, you know, deck. Of course, I, of course, you guys are gonna be like, of course, you know, you have to use Switch to, you know, play the deck. But Switch is very good in their early game. Also, the IX10. <sighs> but you know, again, if you have RNG like this, you pretty much cannot win because you really have to. Uh, A little bit closer, a little bit closer to the edge. Alright. Um I'm gonna go for the bottom row. Because it's again it's closer to the thing. So I will get hit by night, so I I guess it doesn't matter, but hmm, hopefully night gives us a better board than this. No, it's board. I don't even have switch. Oof. Uh. Yep. I think we lost. This guy's landmine for some reason. Um, I can't believe I'm gonna lose by a, you know to a landmine, but rip. Bad RNG, honestly. This game. You know, it can sometimes just frick around and you can just have bad RNG. Why did I just do that? <laughs> so, I had a little brain fart and I'm just gonna go for this. Yep, there's no way I'm gonna win this, so I'm just gonna surrender. You know, it's, it's done. Bad RNG. This is another terrible RNG, but at least it's not all supplement like last time. So I'm kind of, you know, you know, surviving here and there. If I get one uh, yin yang, it's gonna be very nice. But the game's like, nope, you're never gonna get yin yang. Get out of my face! Are you kidding me? I might have to make a desperate move because I need yin yang activated. Uh desperate move. I can't do anything else. Um switch is 
and it does it has the highest dps so at least i'm doing that oh this is so tricky okay can i actually get this thing to work no it can't uh, rip I know what I could have done. I know that as well. But I wasn't quick enough. Yeah, just... yeah. Okay. Horrible start. I know... I Guys, I know what I could have done, okay? That was completely my fault. Um, a little RNG in the, in the start, but, you know... When Magician came, I could have prevented from happening. But... Um, I wasn't quick enough. Um, it's still in the morning, you know. Yeah, that, that this is the play. Now I see it. <laughs> Dang. Well, I guess this is a good example that you can always come back from a bad or bad start. I guess you know, if I win, this might be you know one of those things that are like oh you can always you can come back from a very bad start i guess it's kind of like boomerish but you know oh this guy's about to lose what what hmm, okay should i make him annoy nah not not yet not yet can this guy even survive uh, i guess he will yeah yeah, now it's the time. That was actually night boss. What the? F hmm, this guy's RNG is pretty good, but I feel like it's gonna change once more, so doesn't matter. Yep. <laughs> hey, uh, can I do something to stop? Oh no, this guy lost. All right, this is going to be the my last game. Um. Yeah. <laughs> also, if you guys have made it to the end, um, please leave in the comments saying, you know, about something about gear and what, you know, what 111% should do to gears. Because, you know, gear is, you know, it's not doing well at the moment because of yin yang and stuff, so. <laughs> I don't know, I, I always try to do this to see how many of the people actually watch my full videos. Because if they don't watch it, honestly, it's not worth my time to make long videos. Because if I already know people aren't going to watch it, then what's the point of me trying? Ooh, this guy. <laughs> hmm. I see a lot of the same decks. Oh, power up. Yeah. SP managing should be a lot easier now. Not managing, uh, SP gathering. Ooh, come on. Okay. Hmm, kinda wish this was over here, but that was my fault for not putting supplement near that. So, my fault, my fault. Oof. There's a lot of IX, I mean not IX10, Yin Yangs in the higher classes, which I don't really like, but at, at least this deck can, you know, really, you know, can be a game changer. Royal might be better, um, if, uh, as soon as I get my hands on Royal Dice, I'll probably make a video on it, because I think it's that good of a counter to Yin Yang. It, it can be a counter to pretty much anything, but... But if it's like a sac assassin player, then it's it might help them. So, hmm, I'm gonna get rid of that. If I ban this guy's three pip, it's game over. Oh, what? I'm dealing a lot of damage. Nice. It's 
So I'm gonna power this max. I'm gonna wait, I'm gonna take a break from merging. No, I'm not. Hmm. I honestly have to go very aggressive, like, you know, because he's another IX10 user. Oof. Ah. Well. I extend if you're gonna be around, um, this is your time to shine, my buddy. And I'm not forcing you, but you know, if you, if you're near, you know, it's gonna help me a lot. You know, just saying. <laughs> ah, yes, the negotiator. I can actually do some creative things with this with the switch but nah I'm just gonna go do that instead aggressive no don't leave the game you're annoying <laughs> No, please. No. Hmm. The start of the game was very, you know, nice. I, I felt like I was gonna get a pretty nice, you know, live commentary, but I guess not. Like decent to bad. Uh, IX10 RNG. Yeah, it's not targeting the activated ones. Oh, no. I think I'm just helping this guy at this point. No, my modern just shut off. What did I ban? I don't even know. Can I ban like one of his activated ones, please? Just, you know, please. Ah. I did, but. Is it time for a gamble? Okay. I don't really want to risk it, but I had to. Hmm. Oh, I think I lost. There's clearly no way I'm going to live. Yeah, this is the best I can do. Unless... <sighs> and it targets the unactivated one. Of course, my RNG sucks. Like, there are more activated ones than the deactivated ones. And it still targets the deactivated ones. No, what am I doing? No, this is better. No, it's not. No, it's not. Oh, yes, it is. <laughs> I thought this was going to activate if I do that. Hmm. Uh, so I think I lost. Um, I think I was way too aggressive. Yeah.
Yeah, there's nothing really I can do. Bad RNG, as you guys have seen, you know. Anyway, I think I'll end up the video there. Um, And yeah, thanks for watching again. If you have made it to the end, please comment something about gear and, you know, maybe your experience of gear. The gear dice. Um, My experience were pretty good when I first started the game. I really liked gear. But other than that, that has been this video. Um, and I'll see you guys on the next video. And yeah, next video, I hope it's an edited video. Um, and if you guys want to see more live commentary like this, um, please subscribe and like the video and leave it in the comment that saying, you know, you like the video. Not, not, not the button, but like, you like this kind of content, please make more, something like that. Anyway. Have a good day and bye.